Hey guys, we are about to go on our whale shark adventure. We're super excited. Oh whale, why don't you, you, come along. And, <laughs> and we should have a great day today. The kids are with their Spanish teacher. Um, so, hey Miss Emily, thank you. Hola. <laughs> um, and so Ryan and I are kind of, this is our celebration for our 14th anniversary. year anniversary. Cheers. Cheers. So anyway. Congratulate us in the comments. <laughs> <laughs> so anyway, we'll be, we're about to head out and um, we left at 6 a.m. this morning. Uh, arrived to the bus uh, from Playa. It took us about an hour to get to Cancun. And I think our tour was super on sale. We paid less than a hundred dollars per person and there are um, I think six people on our tour and it should be an awesome day. We're looking forward to it. So come see the whale sharks with us. Whale sharks. The boat is a rocking. It's, Don't come a knocking. It's a good thing you like Dramamine. <laughs> yeah. Gonna need that Dramamine. Hello. Morning. Morning. Ready for the action? See, si. bring it on. That's great. So we're on the boat, and my friend Mario said that this is the best tour he's ever been on with the whale sharks. There's our fearless leader. Luigi, after I want your email. Luigi, see. That's Mario, and I'm Luigi today on the boat. So come on, boat is a rocking. Time to get a knocking. So just some information: the tour cost us right at. $100 that includes the port fee that you pay um, at the port to get on the boat so generally from what I was seeing online I would expect with transportation coming from Playa del Carmen from Playa Car this would run about $150 to $170 a person yeah so don't expect to get the $100 yep. price this it seems COVID. <laughs> yeah that, yeah unfortunately um, generally I think the best price you possibly could find is probably $125 yeah. So I think you could get that, but expecting that 150 to 170 range um, to pay. I think you get two to three swims with the, the whale sharks here. And then you get a lunch, some ceviche, 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 ceviche. ceviche. and then some beers on the way back. I love you got your snorkel in right now for snorkeling. Ready to go. Yeah. This man, Mario, got kicked by a whale shark. Yeah. <laughs> That's a... Vicious. That is a... Like a horse. Bah! Get out of my way. Social distance, you fool. <laughs> Don't you know coronavirus can infect the whale shark? <laughs> That's awesome. Oh, I love it, Mario. Yeah, Luigi's got very, very good. So I got my flippers on, snorkel on, sitting on the side of the boat, getting ready to go. There's beautiful Amanda. Jump, jump! Back to the boat. That's the worst words to hear when you're whale sharking. Back to the boat. 
That was insane. Oh my gosh. That was the best. Manta rays, whale sharks, all around. <laughs> Alright, so what just happened, Amanda? Ryan put my phone in his pocket and swam with it. Luckily, it's waterproof, which is one of the reasons we got it for the trip. But it could have easily fallen. But I mean, 14 years of marriage. That would have happened. It would have been a good run, it baby. Been a good run. Good. <laughs> I'd be Samsung gone. Just kidding. <laughs> yeah, there's the phone. It went in my pocket to swim with the whale sharks and the manta rays. So did you? Mr. Fuss. Oh, gracias. Okay. Cheers. So that was mind blowing. How we described it is you had an appetizer of three manta rays, stunning, huge mouth as big as the whale shark. Then we had the main course came right up and it was the whale shark. And I was pretty excited. I didn't know we were going to get dessert, but we did. And then the manta ray came again with its huge mouth. And then on the way back to the boat, uh, did you see the whale shark that went right under us? No, I missed it. Oh, that's why I was late getting back to the boat, because one went right under me and someone was tapping me, maybe you, to swim. And I'm like, whoa, am I supposed to swim over the whale shark? So I went with it, and then I just swam over it for a little bit longer. And then they said, Luigi, get back to the boat. It was amazing. So. Incredible. Bucket list, check. Yes. So cool. Manta ray, check. I do see why though, this is not really super kid friendly and that you have to swim so fast so far. Very quickly, because I wanted to take one of our daughters, but hopefully like in the next couple of years we'll be able to take them. Oh, it's yeah. incredible. It's amazing, just these Woo! docile, huge, yeah. huge creatures. Yeah. I mean, that was... That was amazing. Yeah, mind blowing. So, I'm going to go take deep breath and kiss Woo! this beautiful lady on our anniversary. Happy anniversary. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. It's the only type of splash to make. A man splash! <laughs> Amanta! <laughs> Amanta! <laughs> ah! Squirrel! I'm gonna get you! <laughs> so they say Corona lives on the beach, but if you're here, you're safe. So, advanced training. So this is the point where we've been on the tour a long time and everyone has to pee. So you notice everyone doesn't move very much. And then the beer gets flowing, and the beer gets flowing! Yeah, hey, no one's moving yet. It takes a good five minutes. <laughs> Gotta get out the pee. Don't act like you didn't pee. I have not peed in this water. <laughs> Alright, take a poll in the comments. Did Amanda pee in the water? Yes or no? My sources say yes, because it was 10 degrees warmer around her. No, it is not. <laughs> Alright, so we are done with the tour, just got dropped off. And we are heading to the one place every American loves. Starbucks. Starbucks. So that was an amazing experience. What'd you think? Awesome. hundred times I'd love to do it again. So, Gotta do it. Loved it, but um, if you don't know, I'm Ryan. This is Amanda. This is Upton Family Adventures. If you like this video, please make sure to like and subscribe and leave a comment below. Yeah, more to on, come. Yeah, oh, yeah. And we're gonna go get some coffee. So we'll see you later. All right, buddy, so how was it? Good. What'd you do? Like, go in the pool and play hide and seek. And you said you did what? What was there a lot of? Do like hide and seek. You said there was a lot of Spanish. Uh-huh. <laughs> involved. Well, that's fun. A lot of Spanish was involved. Well, we love that. So this is awesome. While well, we're gone, Miss Emily and the crew, 
labeled in Spanish. So you have your puerta for the door. You had the coquina kitchen. Refrigerator. Refrigerator. Well, that's a tough one. A la zona. Micro, so everything was labeled, so the kids are learning Espanol, yeah! Woo woo, Miss Emily for the win! <laughs>